what's up you guys we are back with another install and we are working with a two-part wig today this wig is from wig encounters and this is brazilian virgin hair and this is a 22 inch wig and it is 180 percent density and like i said before it is a t-part wig and the lace is transparent and the cap size is average so it's not small medium or large it's just like the standard cap for everybody and I'm just cutting it because I did want to have like a short little cute look. And if I recall, I think I did a T-part wig with Winnick Wig Encounters before. And I think I cut it too. So I don't know what it is with me and cutting wig encounters here. But <laughs> I don't know. So I am going to be using this Bold Hold Liquid Gold. Because when I do T-part wigs, I just feel like they're so like quick that I don't even need to add no glue. So I just went ahead and did the Bold Hold Liquid Gold. And this day, I really didn't feel like using a cap. So yeah. But um, what I'm doing is just the standard, just the standard little, you know, putting it on and blow drying it. And the color for this wig did come pre-colored. So all the information for this wig will be down below. And also I do have a discount code so you guys can get 20% off of your order. So make sure you guys check the description box down below. But we're just going to, you know, go through the motions and I'll come back in a second. So when I was cutting this lace for this install, um, I did kind of cut it a little weird. So I did have to like go back and fix it. And it is a glueless. So when you are cutting the lace on a glueless, you will see like a little white cast. But it's okay because you can go ahead and spray it with any of your hairspray that you like to use. And it'll go away. So for the sides, I really, um, I put lace glue on the sides because... They just wasn't sticking for me that day. I don't think I put enough of the boat hole liquid gold. And I was kind of rushing. So I just wanted to, you know, get it on there. So I did put a little bit of lace glue on the side.
almost done with these curls and as you guys can see i really love the texture of this hair this hair is so bouncy and cute and it gives me like natural vibes a little bit and that's why i always say that tea park wigs are beginner friendly because it just really introduces you to like the whole wig act aspect like the whole frontal wig aspect without giving you all that space to work with and you know jumping out there trying to do your first wig install i feel like a tea part wig is a very good beginner friendly unit to do and you guys see these curls i'm just using my spritz to put down the flyways but these curls are bomb and the middle part was bomb and the curls just look so like even though the hair is kind of curled, the cur like colored, the curls just look like they're moisturized. Like I don't, <laughs> I don't know, you guys. Don't mind the little part that's not curled on the back. You know, I had to go back and do that part. But this is just how the hair looks, and this is actually a day after, so I didn't actually curl the hair. I just let the curls sit, and you guys can see how it looks. But I'm really, really pleased with this hair, and Wig Encounters hair is always really good. This is like my second time working with them, and I really would recommend them for you know purchasing their wigs so like i said before check the description box down below and thank you guys for watching this video stay blessed i love you guys